I got really, really toasted and there's a 7-Eleven right next to my house. Now, sometimes it's very safe. Majority of the time, it's very not. Like there's some crazy motherfuckers that walk in and out of that. Did, hold on, just so, morning. just so I'm clear, you're just going to roll with the story. Yes. That you're, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, you stopped. <laughs> I had my hand raised. This is respect. <laughs> So I get there, mind you, the whole time in my heart, I'm praying. I was like, please God, don't let anybody like come and beat me up or anything like that. There's a crazy guy outside, but me and him are Gucci because I always get him snacks and he loves me. So that guy's good. I get past him and I'm, I'm at the, the, the fucking, I'm getting my Powerade that I thirstily needed at three o'clock in the morning. I'm going to drink and some five guys walk in. Get the fuck down. Put it in the fucking bag. I shit bricks immediately slide down throw my back against the chips and try to hide in them and i realize i go oh my god i can't get out of there there's no other exit then you just hear ha 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 my boy how are you doing <laughs> <laughs> Bro, i am sitting there fully submerged in chips I, all the chips that i put my back into are completely popped and broken crushed crushed <laughs> i put my thing i go like this and they go haha my friend they're all like the same ethnicity and they're dapping each other up they're laughing they had no idea i was in there for them to do this joke i come out and they all knew they fucked up because they see my face is completely white and i put the drink down and the guy goes we were just joking and i go yeah no it's a couple seconds late but whatever you know what you should have done should have popped up from behind where you were and went no, no, put your fucking hands in the air <laughs> Los Angeles police, get LAPD, down! Get down! <laughs> Anaconda, get down! <laughs> Yo, those are the kind of things that only happen to you when you're too high to handle them, too. No you are smart. You no are baked. fucking way you are is baked. I gonna handle that shit. No fucking way, bro. You were baked, right? Baked. And by the way, dude, like, I just a little FYI, like, like reality's not like fucking movies, bro. My dad put me in self defense class my whole fucking life. I've learned from other people fake guns how to steal their fucking guns away from them, right? Show, show me. Bop, like that. Take yeah, the gun yeah. and put it against a, a guy. Put a gun in front of me. All of that knowledge, fucking gone. I just pissed in my pants <laughs> and hung up the phone with my mom because I didn't want her to hear me die. George, George. all of those classes were n worth nothing. Guy's like, what do you got? I go, ah, whatever you want. And I just started peeing. George is like the dudes on TikTok when they try to disarm somebody. Like, I don't know. Welcome to the gulag. And it's Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> just automatic failure. So you were you were so stoned. Yeah, bro. He's but like, he's like, there's one other part of the story. Then I woke up, I realized I'm like, damn, I'm not even at 7 Eleven. <laughs> I'm in a recliner in my apartment. <laughs> I'm never getting weed from Mike ever again. <laughs> the H9X strain. 